Since its completion in the summer of 2003, the indoor practice facility has been the hub of BYU athletics, as well as intramural and extramural sports. As the temperatures go down outside, usage of the IPF goes up. But how does BYU decide who gets to use the facility? Let's take a closer look. Each spring, the BYU football team uses the indoor practice facility to begin prep for the next season. Along with the football team, other BYU sports like golf, baseball, softball, track and field, and soccer also rely on the facility to train during colder months. The IPF was first announced by then-BYU President Merrill J. Bateman at a football game in September of 2002. In this article written by BYU Magazine, Bateman is quoted saying, We have known for a long time that in order to maintain and continue our athletic success, we must provide the very best resources and facilities for our student-athletes. BYU's new athletic complex will achieve that objective. So, was the IPF intended for just athletes? What about other BYU students? Today, multiple groups, including BYU athletics, intramurals, extramurals, and academic classes, all work together to schedule the IPF. It works out pretty well. I think most groups are happy to have the opportunity they have to be in there. Over 10,000 students participate in intramural sports each year, and a major portion of that group uses the IPF for intramural soccer really opened up our winter semester soccer. When that uh, facility opened up, we decided to experiment with winter semester soccer, and it was wildly popular right out the gate. Some disagree with how the facility is used, saying athletes should have full access to the indoor fields. Former BYU football player Hans Olsen said he's witnessed BYU athletes, quote, shooed off the field to give time to intramural students, something he said needs to be reconsidered. As for now, the groups will continue to share time with the IPF, providing an opportunity for all BYU students to use the facility. BYU students will continue to share the IPF for classes, sports teams, clubs, and intramural games. Currently, the facility is used all day with classes in the morning, practices in the afternoon, and intramural contests in the evening.